hey y'all welcome back to my channel i haven't seen y'all since last year that sounds terrible i haven't seen y'all since last year but i'm back with another video um in this video i'm going to be doing a get to know me tag because i feel like y'all really don't know nothing about me besides um i do makeup videos i do some hair videos you know when i do a couple vlogs here and there but y'all really don't know me as a youtuber so i feel like why not do this being my first video in 2020 so you guys can get to know me so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video and i hope it gives you guys a little insight on who i am as a youtuber and yeah but before you guys get into this video please make sure you give it a big thumbs up hit the subscribe button and turn those post notifications bells on so you're notified every single time I make a post and let's get into it okay first question you know this is really gonna bother me because i got my glasses on and y'all gonna see the ring light the whole time but whatever okay First question, where are you from? I am from Akron, Ohio, 330. I think it's really small. I think it's small here. I feel like everybody know everybody's business. It's just really, really small. I mean, I think it's cool. It ain't really that much to do here, but it's okay. Um, Next question, how tall are you? I am 5'2", but I really feel like I'm like 6'3", so there's that um dogs or cats i like dogs i like dogs but they have to be small like i don't like them big dogs because those those too big and mm -mm. i like small ones like i'm talking like chihuahua teacup yorkie small i don't like cats i'm pretty sure i'm allergic to them i went to a friend's house before and i broke up like it was like a whole bunch of bumps on my chest it looked disgusting and i'm pretty sure that's because she had a cat never again absolutely not no ma'am um are you in college if so what is your major i am in college i go to the university of akron go zips um my major is pre-med i am on the biology track and i'm minoring in child development and american sign language yep uh-huh that's me sign language i'm not gonna fake i feel like a lot of people should really think about sign language because like when you get to college you have to take a foreign language i feel like sign language is really really dope it's fun it's kind of easy a little bit when you study but I feel like it's really, really cool. So I feel like if you're going to college and you're thinking about taking a foreign language, you think you're going to take Spanish, no. Take American Sign Language. You'll enjoy it. Um, What's my spirit animal and why? Now, I will be typical and say a lion, but like, I don't think that's my spirit animal. So I'm going to say my spirit animal is i'm gonna say it's a wolverine and i'm gonna say a wolverine because they low-key small but wolverines can eat moose i was really watching this netflix show and i don't know what it's called like animal planet type stuff but i really been into it as of lately don't judge me and it was a wolverine and they ate a moose but my question was like why would they even be in the same vicinity but that was none of my concern i just know that I'm pretty sure my spirit animal is mm -hmm. the same. If I'm wearing one, what would it be? Um, It would definitely be... I have two options on this one. So, my first option would be my Versace one. And I got it so I can show y'all. It's Versace Bright Crystal. This, honey, right here, you can spray this on your clothes on Monday and it will still be on you that Friday, okay? All you need is literally a squirt. I do too because I'm extra, but all you need is a squirt. This stuff right here, I wish I could squirt it and y'all could just smell. But it just, it just smells, oh my God, it just smells, oh, it's amazing. Like, I could walk past somebody in a store and walk back down the aisle a couple minutes later and my scent is still there, honey. My next favorite one is Pink Chiffon. Um, This one is a body fragrance you can get it from bath and body works but this one right here it is a body fragrance so you got to squirt this thing like 30 times 
for it to last on you the whole day i squirted i'm not i'm not trying to be funny i really squirted like at least like 40 times just so it lasts but this is definitely a favorite as well but this right here right here i'm gonna get you some you won't regret it piercings um, and tattoos do you have um i have one two three do y'all count like like do y'all count like individually like the pure the ear the holes in my ear if so okay so we just gonna say i'm counting those separately so if i'm counting each piercing in my ear separately i have a total of nine piercings and i'll have like pictures and stuff on the side so y'all can see so i have three in each ear and then i have my helix pierced did i say that right i have my helix pierced up here and my mom actually pierced yeah my mom pierced my two holes and she pierced my helix uh-huh and then i went to good life and oh i went to good life for both i went to good life for my nose and my belly pierced. i have three tattoos i just got one yesterday it's absolutely my favorite tattoo i have on my body i'm gonna add to it i'm gonna get like flowers and it's gonna be really nice um but i'll have like pictures and stuff so y'all can see the tattoos and piercings that i do have um single and i am happily taken by my boyfriend dante picture will be right here he's been on my youtube channel a couple times but yeah yeah um goals so i literally go back and forth with this question like a lot because i just be thinking about it like who just don't think about their life at night weird okay so i think my in life goal would be to did i say that right my in life goal would be i just want to be genuinely happy with whatever career choice i choose to do i want to be genuinely happy so i'm really like indecisive between becoming a pediatrician or a physician assistant specializing in pediatrics so pediatrician everybody know is hella schooling for it physician assistant is literally like a year or two off like deducted from that type of schooling but i honestly feel like for the longest i've always wanted to become a pediatrician so it's only right that i become a pediatrician because i really want to give back to my community i want to go to um impoverished areas and i want to give back my service so by me becoming a pediatrician and i can go give back my services i can do clinics free clinics checking patients out and stuff like that so that's something i really want to do i'm really really big on like the black lives movement honey because that's a whole nother youtube video right there but we're not gonna get into that we're not gonna get into that but yeah so i would say my end goal is to be become a pediatrician i want to be genuinely happy and i want to be financially and mentally stable i want to be financially stable honey i want to be able to take care of my parents i want to be able to take care of my family they don't need taken care of but i just feel like they deserve it because they invested so much in me and my schooling and everything else so. siblings i have one little brother Oh, it's a picture of him right there, but y'all can't really see. Y'all, he's been in my YouTube videos too, but I'll insert a picture of him as well. He's 11 years old. Kind of annoying, but that's my bestie, so yeah. Um, Birthday and my age. My birthday is July 27th, so I am a Leo, Um, and I'm 19 years old. I'll be 20 this year. Oh my God, that sounds so, so, so old. Oof. Mm. One thing y'all wouldn't know about me would be I'm super, super, super blunt. I'm very outspoken. I don't bite my tongue, which can be a good or bad thing, depending on the situation. I'm really trying to work on it because sometimes I like say what I want to say and just be so blunt about it that it really does hurt people's feelings because people are really sensitive and, you know, I guess I could tend to hurt people's favorite feelings. Favorite YouTuber, my all-time favorite YouTuber is All of Destiny. I love all of Destiny. Okay, I commented on one of her um videos she posted and she literally commented back to me and I went crazy, okay? Because I love all of Destiny. Um a couple other ones I like is Glam and Gore. I'm really into like the SFX um makeup and stuff now. So she was somebody that I actually looked into when I was like interested in SFX. Am I saying it right? SFX. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm saying it right. Um Sophiology, Anaya Ivy. I bought some bundles from her. You know what? That's a whole nother story for a whole nother YouTube video, but we'll get into that. Um, Kiki Adams, she does like really nice makeup tutorials and they're really easy to catch on to. Josh and Easy, they're a couple's channel, but I feel like they're the most realistic couple out there. I know DR and Ken, like everybody bandwagon them, but 
I'm not gonna lie like i'm really not a fan i think they're a cute couple but i'm really not a fan i really like josh and evie um and my last one of course is Aaliyah j um favorite tv <sighs> i honestly don't know um i really like cooking shows and like baking shows so i would say like kids baking championship i love me some power okay power I love it. We could talk about it all day long. I love Power. Um, I have Disney Plus now, so I've been rewatching like Proud Family and Nassau Raven, so stuff like that. Um, my favorite, I don't really know. I love like cartoon movies, so I like um, Finding Nemo, Finding Dor Dory, Lion King. Uh, I really love The Grinch, Stuart Little. I don't know stuff like. That. I guess that's not a cartoon movie. I don't have a favorite movie. And the last would be a bad habit that I have. I really don't know. I asked my boyfriend and he said that I get irritated quickly, but I don't personally think that's my bad habit. I have no idea what my bad habit is. Um, I think my a bad habit I have is that I tend to uh, speak before I think. And I think sometimes that can bite me in the butt sometimes. Like my mom always tell me I need to think before I speak because sometimes when I speak it comes off like I said it can be very very harsh and I'm not saying I'm about to twist up twist up how I want to say something and sugarcoat it because somebody is really really sensitive no nah, that's not me um but yeah I think I need to think before I speak sometimes but yeah so that is question tag or whatever get to know me tag I hope you guys got to know me a little bit more as a youtuber um, I do have a lot in store this year. Black History Month is next month, and I'm super, super excited. If you follow me on Instagram, then I have, like, a little... Actually, it's a big highlight. It's not a little highlight. It's a big highlight. It's my favorite highlight on my Instagram channel. Um, a highlight of, like, um, Black History movies to watch, um, where to get cool t-shirts at for cheap, all of that stuff on there. Um, I don't know what I want to do, but I really want to do something for Black History Month on my YouTube channel. So, you know um so yeah i have a lot in store in 2020 um i'm gonna keep progressing with these videos and giving y'all new videos and stuff like that um yeah i hope y'all got to know me a little bit more like i said and i'll see you in my next video